lot of you that don't know, I run a 750 person fixed brand called Vader, Under Armour, and Chase, and Toyota, and Pepsi. And the amount of money that is wasted, just, just watch what I'm about to show you, and I think we can all agree there's not, this is not a 14 year old girl crowd. Raise your hand if you now, when you watch television, fast forward every single commercial, or watch Netflix or HBO Go, if you, when your favorite show airs, you don't watch when it airs, you watch it now on your time. Raise your hands. I just want everybody to look around, keep them up. Especially front row, look at this. Let me just give you the punchline. Everybody. And how many people here, if they're still using DVR TiVo, fast forward every single commercial when given the option. And so, even if something crazy like the remote control falls off the bed, Every person here grabs this any time that there is a commercial. Yet, $80 billion is spent by the biggest brands in the world to make 30 second videos of a Jeep going up a hill or some guy grabbing a beer or some lady with a baby using some oil. $80 billion is completely not practical and broken and of the Fortune 500 biggest brands in the world have declined in market share over the last two years. Here is what that is that money is. All that money, all that money is coming from the system. Once they start calibrating how bad it actually is, Coca-Cola, from a commercial of guiding money. And they take those dollars and they put them into Facebook and Instagram, the price of our attention is gonna go through the roof. So I sit here today and plea, and I plea, that if you are not activating your marketing in that ecosystem, you are gonna miss the golden era of Facebook marketing and you will regret it. And people run around here, there are people in this room that run around here with an opinion on Facebook marketing and they've never deployed a single ad on it. There are people here that run around and have opinions on Instagram marketing and have never deployed a single penny on it, period. Also, we sit here today in early November 2016 when the greatest marketing arbitrage besides Facebook advertising is influencer marketing. You may not like it, you may not think it's cool that people have detox tea pictures in their Instagram or that fucking wasted that freaks me the fuck out. <laughs> but it doesn't take away the fact that right now, even in a B2B environment, 